Hi, I'm Jennifer, founder and CEO of Keepster. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to navigate your way around the Keepster app. So once we've logged in, we can start looking at the app closer. The hamburger menu is on the top right hand corner and it's pretty self-explanatory. Projects and orders refer to the Keepster books that you might make or for books that you've already paid for. The orders tab will help you track the progress of your order and indicate whether the books have been shipped or delivered. And that's also where you will have the option to reorder another copy of the book. The projects tab is where you can go to make changes to the cover, the title page, dedication page, and where you can preview books before ordering them. To view your billing details, address book for shipping books, preferred language, book pricing and binding options, FAQs and support contact information, please click on the relevant tabs. Clicking on the My Account tab is where you would change your email address or, pa or password. At the bottom of the menu is where you sign out of Keepster. We strongly suggest that you sign out of Keepster every time you are done using it, just to be sure that no one but you can view your messages. Please remember though, you will need your password to log back in again. On most screens, there is a home button in the top left-hand corner, which will always bring you back to the screen when, where you can view your list of Keepsters or your list of backups. And at the bottom of each screen is our friendly chat box, which you can click on at any point with your questions and our support team will get back to you as soon as possible. For more tips about how to use Keep Keepster, please refer to the other videos that we've made and you can also always click on our FAQs. We hope you'll find the app easy and intuitive to use and just hope you have lots of fun using it. Thanks.